Today we have a very unusual gaming peripheral. You wanna check this out? Okay. Look what I found here. This is the Wii car adapter. The Wii car adapter. That How sounds like a bad idea. This is not endorsed by Nintendo. This is some weird Yobo party. gameware. Yobo gameware. And uh, there's a few of these. I think a few different brands have done the same thing. But it, all it says is Wii car power adapter. Okay. Used in car. And this is the original <laughs> Wii? <laughs> well, this one, I guess, is the original Wii. I think they have it for Wii U also. But, okay. Uh, look at the back. There's almost nothing. Use for Wii console only. It doesn't say anything about driving. There's no or... instructions, no warnings. It, yeah, no you, know, you like, think it would say on there like don't, it, like I mean, don't you know, drive and play the game at the same yeah, time. Yeah, like obviously it's intended for the passenger, but you you know that there's idiots out there who would, you know, like like right. they, they want to cover their ass, but this this well, it doesn't is, say that you this don't is have just to. Some, yeah, this is probably like some company that just put out one thing and like it's not, you right. know, it doesn't really care. So this is pretty weird. This is basically a lawsuit because, waiting to happen. Because here's the thing, isn't that what the DS is for? Like, you know, the Nintendo DS, you know, portable games. Oh yeah, yeah, sure. that's in the back like, of the car. This, this is in case the portable games aren't enough for you. Yeah. In case you want them. No, <laughs> but you can't sit in the back seat and play like yeah. New like, Super Mario Brothers, the Wii version, Skyward Sword. Yeah, I guess. So if you want to play Skyward Sword, if you want a really, car, really long car trip and you just have to play those if you're driving games. around the entire world and, like twice <laughs> and the Wii like I, the Wii U makes a little more sense because it's sort of a portable thing to begin with like kind of because it, it's got the controller with that monitor on it when I think Wii I think of like you know using the the nunchuck and the the Wii mode yeah, pointing it at around. the television yeah. yeah it's not really like you have to have the sensor you know it's not really like a meant to be like a portable thing definitely like, not like dude I want to play the power pad while driving <laughs> make that happen you know? yeah, yeah. <laughs> so like I said obviously it's meant for the passenger but even then it sounds a little dangerous. Could you imagine swinging a Wiimote around when somebody's trying to drive a car? It's meant for people in the back seat, I think. Yeah, I th well, it's a, it's a car adapter. Now I know I know some cars have the the power adapter in in the back of the, the AC port, but um, yeah, usually it's in the front. There, yeah. So if your car only has the adapter in the front, then the passenger is going to have to be like swinging around while this <laughs> person trying to drive. Terrible thing to imagine. Obviously, we don't recommend this. Not for definitely not for the driver, and probably not for the passenger either. Yeah, just probably not. not a good idea. But um, theoretically, if someone were to do this, I was just very curious as to technically how would it work. So I looked into it, and here you go. This seems to be um, from the UK only. Okay. So this is the travel pack. I'm not sure entirely, but I couldn't find any in the States. It may be in Europe, but uh, it's definitely in the UK. I don't know if in the rest of Europe or not. It looks like you're taking the Wii on a picnic. This is how they got it really figured out. So if you want to take the Wii in the car, this is how you do it. It already took it out of the box, <laughs> set it up and everything. I can't believe so this, this is, is like a real thing. Yeah, like check this out. Like you just be, you know, traveling around with your Wii in the backpack here. So here you go. Unzip it, flop it out. Yeah, and then you got your way. So, well, so basically, this <laughs> see it folds up. Oh, you yeah, got the yeah. monitor. You got this thing here. Oh. So basically, what this is is just a plastic case, and you put your Wii oh, inside see, it. Oh, see, now I thought it was for the TVs mm -hmm. that flip down, like in the back seat. Oh, for like the those kids. kind, like a way to hook it up. Yeah. I mean, who knows? So there's an Maybe. actual monitor. Yeah, this is an actual monitor made specifically for the Wii. It appears it comes with like a, a plastic case or like a plastic tray, I should say. You put your Wii here, and, and you can see how they have it, how it perfectly fits. Yeah, you know, fits. that's so interesting. I always yeah. I always wonder why, like, the mm -hmm. side of the Wii had, like, that sort of... Oh, it's for this. Cut. It's for, I guess it's for this, the travel case. <laughs> so it fits perfectly in there. It's all white. You know, it, it it's designed perfectly as if it was meant for the Wii all along. Yeah, it doesn't look bad. Yeah. I mean, and all you do is you connect it to... Um, this little squid thing. Okay. You, you connect it here. This is the AV uh, signal, and here you have the power, which goes into the Wii, sure. and this plugs into the car adapter. So the cigarette lighter powers up the Wii and the monitor. And now you're probably wondering, what about the sensor bar? Yeah. Obviously, you need your sensor bar to play the Wii. You hook it up like usual. Now there is a, another peripheral. Um, it's the uh, Cobra sensor stand by Dragon. It's basically a suction type uh, stand that yeah. mounts to your windshield and it holds your sensor bar right on your uh, windshield for you. This sounds insane. The sensor stand is extremely rare, like extremely. Like I only found like one on the internet okay. anywhere. 
and it's taking like three months to ship. So we're gonna have to wait for that. Okay. <laughs> Not like we're ever but gonna use it. But could you just put it, the sensor on, on your dashboard or something? I suppose you could duct tape it or something, but this, yeah. at that point, once you're duct taping a sensor to your car, like, go do something else. <laughs> <laughs> What's Nintendo amazing is that this down. came out mm -hmm. for the Wii, but then yeah. it also came out for the Wii U. You think yeah. they, they would've got a lawsuit for the Wii and never would've tried it, but then it uh -huh. also came out for the Wii yeah. U. <laughs> So it's insane. Well, but, the Wii U, I imagine you would just use the controller with the, the monitor, you know. The, to be fair though, I think this product is intended for kids to probably play in the back seat. It's mm, not intended yeah. for somebody to play in the front seat. Which means you have to have the, the cigarette lighter in the back. Yeah, so the mm -hmm. parent would be driving, the kid mm -hmm. is in the back, the, the console's plugged into the back mm -hmm. cigarette outlet. outlet and so then, even that's bad, because if the kid's swinging the Wiimote around, the driver's in the front, what if you hit the driver? It's just a bad idea head? altogether. Oh yeah, totally. Well, oh, but, also, in some games, you know how they, the the Wii has the the wrist strap. What if the kid's playing it and the and the fucking Wii mote goes flying out of his hand mm -hmm. and hits the windshield? Yeah, it's anything just a, it's, just, it's actually a really <laughs> dangerous bad idea. Huh. Well, let's try it out. Yeah. All right, James and I are in the car, and now I'm setting up the Wii Travel Pack. First thing is to set up the sensor bar. I'm putting it on top of here, but obviously that's gonna slide right the fuck off. Look at that. It's just gonna slide off. So that's why. You have duct tape. It's masking tape, but still. Well, same thing. Masking tape. <laughs> you know what I meant. We're gonna just tape that down like that. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Now we got this. This goes in to the fucking Wii. Get in there. There we go. And now okay. this goes into the cigarette lighter. And actually, you know what? I know people are gonna complain about this, so let me just fix that. <laughs> yeah, there you go. So now the sensor bar is perfect, all right, guys? And this is plugged in, everything's plugged in. Now we're gonna flip the screen up. Smash Brothers in the car! Can you see the screen? Don't, well, well, keep your eye on the road, too. But can you see the screen? Keep your eye on the road. Can you, but I want you to look what I'm doing. Okay, watch. And yeah, we keep your eye on the road, though. Jeez, we're just, I like me, okay. I wanna get back, back on how's, the platform. How's that game going? We're trying to get back on the platform. Yes! Got him. Let's play some different games. So I brought along uh, Pet Vet. Pet Vet. Chicken Shoot. Chicken Shoot. Chicken Blaster. Chicken Blaster. <laughs> and I got, imagine Party Babies. Yeah, Party Babies! <laughs> but, uh, so should I play one of these? Uh, those all suck. Well, I have also got Samba de Amigo for Wii. Samba de Amigo? Have you ever played Samba de Amigo? Oh. Keep your eyes on the road, Jesus. Oh. You're gonna fucking hit that raccoon. Have you ever played Samba de Amigo? No. No? Well, let's try it out. So basically, in Samba de Amigo, you have your Wiimote and your nunchuck, but as if this isn't crazy enough, you know, playing Wii in the car and everything with the sensor bar on the dashboard, this game also came with adapters itself. The Wii Maracas. If you remember the, you know, Super Mario Kart had the wheel and Link's crossbow training had the crossbow where you could stick the Wiimote into it and play. Well, you can stick the Wiimote into the Wii Maraca, yeah, and you can stick the nunchuck into the Wii Maraca or whatever they call it, the Samba de Amigo Maraca, and shake, 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 shake. Keep riding the fucking road. I want to be in the mood if we're playing some fucking Samba de Amigo. Ay, caramba! <laughs> Let's do this. All right, so in this game, you basically just got to keep up with the rhythm. You never played this before? Oh, watch, watch. Yeah, look, look, look down here, look. Oh, oh, oh! Sorry, oh. sorry. Oh, I'm driving here, I'm driving here. Yeah, but I gotta go left sometimes. See, oh. I'm going up, I'm going down, I'm going right, and now I gotta go left. Oh, now watch, watch, watch out. Watch it, Well, you watch. gotta watch out, I'm trying to play Samba the Amigo, come on. Up, 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 down, down, down. Right, right, right. Left, left, left. Whoa! Oh. 